this is our middle of the night fish cleaning crab cooking setup we got going on so we're out in the bush we pulled up we set up and then it started to bloody rain so now we've just half pulled the awning out keep us a bit dry and this is here we got three you can't really see them three big ass you want me to be yeah so it's not a bad night not bad for a few hours sitting on a jetty anyway darling is cleaning the pussy <laughs> Well, we looked on YouTube and I said, "Oh, you just just hold that and give it a give it a, <laughs> give it a little wiggle." It's black everywhere. Yeah, no black comes out. You know, it's all down there, but no, it's not. It's look. look. <laughs> you have to hold it. Yeah, I'm, I'm doing the wiggly bit first. Oh, wiggling, wiggling. Yeah, but they don't say separate it from the. the see, the spinal bit here is like really. Yeah. Our Australian squid <laughs> must be tougher than American squid. Oh, can't hold it. <laughs> Come on. It's stuck. Come on. Come on, wiggle, wiggle. No. Wiggle, wiggle. <laughs> it doesn't come out. Just give it a little wiggle and it will all pop out in one bit. I think you hold it this. this. Oh, there you go. It's a boy. <laughs> all right. Jesus, look at this. Leaking. I don't want to pour over the food. That there one came go. out easy. Look. Yeah. Ooh. Mm -hmm. It's got a big sack of boogly boogly. <laughs> Alrighty, oh. They got blue eyes. So now. They got blue eyeballs. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that's still full of shit in there. Oh, poor I got her up. No, it doesn't. Yeah, see. Okay. I did not show you how to, to clean it inside it. Right. Now, what do they do now? They still have shit inside. Yeah, with the backbone bit, right? Yeah, like that. They just, okay, okay, you just run your thumb under that bit <laughs> and hold on to it and just pull it gently. <laughs> <laughs> And we'll just slide out like that. Look at that. Where is it? And we, it's just like a bit of plastic, and we discard that. <laughs> you have to run like that, turning, turning, and pull. There you go. Next one, turning and pull. This one. Mm. And that. The wings. Well. Yeah, see? Must easy. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, well, I don't throw the wings away because there's meat on the wings, yeah. and these are big squid. I reckon you step for bait. On the wings. Mm. 
then in the middle or uh, inside yeah we'll inside it's supposed the di to be ah, digestive yeah. well inside apparently it was supposed to have come out with the, the first bit but it and inside that's how you clean it and then slice it round like calamari rings. And cut the head half. What you doing? Garbage. No, this uh, this the bait. No. I use for the bait. Just put the bony bit in there. Mm. Move it out. So it's a calamari strip, not a calamari ring. <laughs> Same with this one too. Yeah, it's broken. Too big. Hmm? It's big. You reckon? Yeah. Oh, well. It's like smaller. Like that. Like that. Yeah. No, you want thin ones. Like that. Soak with milk. Yep. Just milk. Just milk. Because normally, I don't know, people do it for all sorts of times. But old Greek guy I met years and years ago up on the Rapid Bay Jetty Fishing. I was talking to him. I was catching leather jackets, the fish. And I don't really like them. He loved them. So he did a deal and he swapped me a whole bunch of squid for the leather jackets as I was catching them. And he's telling me that soak him in milk. You put it in the milk, uh, 24 hour in the milk, like that. And he goes, Wah, it's the al dente, very, very, not al dente, whatever he says, it's very, very thin. Al dente is Italian, I believe. Oh. Very tender. Tender. Tender spaghetti. So we just, I'll just soak that basically till tomorrow now. We'll sit in the fridge. Mm. You can have really fishy, breakfasty milk if you want, but generally just throw that away <laughs> so how long you soak that 24 hours so 24 tomorrow. hours well until tomorrow a few people do it for a few hours. i know people do it for half an hour an hour three hours six hours whatever mm. everybody's got their own it's idea it's different but i've always done how long it for, you gonna soak oh, i always leave it in there overnight yeah. do it the next day yeah 24 hours cover the glad right and then Double wrap. Well, no, I got that bit up, didn't I? No. Oh, there we go. Oh shit, we're not driving anywhere, so it'll be alright. Uh, make sure you stay it up. Yep, yeah, all good. That's it. Sure. Yep. Alright, and put in the fridge. Put in the fridge for tomorrow, and then today, today we've got a lambe, the lambe, crabs. And beer. <coughs> I'm gonna cook rice. Too. Right. I'm gonna have um. Yay! Baksel fish. And Calamari is done. And lambai. Actually, we're here somewhere in. We're between. Where is that? We're, we're halfway we're between um. 
here and there. Huh? No, no is it done Um, no. Is it done No, miles past. After? No, after is it Port Kenny and Venus Bay. So Port Kenny's just up there and Venus Bay is just over there. So Hi. we're sort of in the middle. How you call that? Port Kenny. Port Kenny. And then Venus Bay. And Venus Bay. Yeah, so yeah. We're, we're almost in the middle, but just on a roadside stop. So it's windy as buggery and all that. So we just pulled over for the night. Yeah. And get that calamari organised. And tomorrow, before we go, we'll, we'll flower it and crumb it and all that ready. Yeah. So tomorrow night, calamari and salad for dinner. In where? Uh, I have no idea where we're going to be. I don't know. I think Port Neil. <laughs> well, we're going to Port Lincoln. Um, I don't know. Mm. Maybe. If, we, if we're going to keep going to Port Neil, I've got to ring the van park up because we're not booked until Thursday. And yeah. we're staying there for a while. A long while. So, and I've got a little something I bought so we can go really fishing. Yeah. Uh, okay. see. And then, that's it. I'm going to have a beer. Mm. All right. Show you outside. So the main road is there, and uh, there's um ocean here too over there, but you can't see. Hi, good morning, guys. Hey, done for packing. And I'm outside before we go. Check the gas if it's closed, if turned off. Then I'm check this brakes and the plug. And also this always check because sometimes we forgot. Twice now, it's not in. Make sure it's in, and also the brake, everything. All right, all good. And under the caravan, all good. Except the van is dirty and the car is dirty. And the pullers. Here we are. Hello. We're gonna roll again. On the road, we're gonna get some hot bread. Yeah. Hot stone bakehouse. And they make like hot buns. Like they call them sticky buns. I don't know. They don't look like sticky buns. They look pretty cool. And I have bread. Oh, it's morning. So we'll get hot bread. And probably some of the buns too. We'll have a look. They're all wicked camps. So they say what they're called. Why did my phone shut down again? Are you ready? Yeah, I'm just going to say what this place is. <clears throat> oh. What's that, what's that the place name? When we stop the dump point and water? That will be Elliston. Allison, yeah. Elliston. Allison. So, but first of all, we're going to stop and bread and buns. <laughs> and then, uh, yeah, we've got Elliston water dump point. Do we have supermarket? Elliston would have, yeah, but we'll see where it is if we can park near it. No, I think we need because it's far from Port, Port Lincoln. Well, yes. Lincoln, oh, Elliston's okay. about 100 k, so it's halfway there. Okay. So, where do you want to stay? Well, if Elliston's got somewhere we can pull up, we'll just pull up there and go to the shop. But Port Lincoln's got Coles and Woolies and all that. Yeah. But parking could be a pain in the ass because yeah, it's Monday be as well. And with the van, so. We'll find somewhere normally. Just pull up, take up 25 car spaces. <laughs> Hi, now we're in Port Lincoln. We're gonna have a van wash. Wow. Yay, excellent. Once is two uh, vans lined up. We're still waiting. Line up. It's 
excellent. All clean. Shopping. Look at where we park. Side of the road. You got a key? Honey, we're home. <laughs> we're home. Look at that, Missy. Don't bring the shopping home. Bring the home to your shopping. Oh. Last one. There's nothing really worth worrying about. So. No. Oh. That's all. Oh. Set in there. Everyone, it's time to come the calamari. Mm. First, she put first she put um, plain flour and eggs. Huh? Eggs with milk. Yeah, egg egg white and a bit of milk. Why yeah. Not? yeah, just put a little bit of milk. And then we put the crumbs. And then red crumbs. And then fried. That's it. Pretty much, yeah. Yeah, you put you put the bridge crumbs, mm, salt and black pepper powder. A little bit this for the mm -hmm. flavor. Yeah. There is cook. Mm. Eh, try. It's in my arm. Yummy. Yep. Wow. Do it again. Mm. <laughs> And dip with mayo? No. Dip I'm with mayo? Right. Come and dip with mayo. Beautiful. Mm. Mm. Wow. Perfect. Yep. And that's my love.